Uh, I asked Harry if he's ever been to therapy, and he said, no, I'm not gay. <laughs> Which is crazy, because the only way Harry wouldn't be gay would be through therapy. <laughs> uh, I am fully gay, by the way. I, Same Love by Macklemore is my favorite song, but all right, that's neither here nor there. Uh, Hunter looks like he doesn't believe in napkins. <laughs> I believe in myself, you know? But not cleaning yourself. <laughs> that was mean. He, no, it's okay, dude. Okay. That's what this is. You're, let You're, it right. Out. You're right. <laughs> Harry is cute, but also kind of Aryan, you know? Harry looks like it could be like the model for a white supremacist clothing line, you know? Like he could be the face for Abercrombie and Lynch. <laughs> My God, I wish, dude. All right. <laughs> All right. Uh, Hunter looks like Lenny from Of Mice and Men, but instead of wanting rabbits, he wants to come on Asian women's feet. <laughs> I don't know. I don't read. I don't know what that means. <laughs> There's a movie on Pornhub. Oh, okay. I know what that is. Um, Harry's dad died of diabetes. He's a diet deadbeat dad. Um, <laughs> so, so Harry's learning to stand on his own two feet because his dad never had any. <laughs> he started with feet. He lost them. All right. The feet were removed. All right. Whatever. Uh, Hunter looks like he loves to have really loud sex with his girlfriend, where his girlfriend's completely silent. I don't have sex with my girlfriend, don't. It's ridiculous that you would say that. I just come on her feet. That's Hell yeah, that's some Karate Kid shit right there, dude. Um, I don't know what that was about. Harry is 5% Jewish, because one time at work, his great-grandfather inhaled a whole bunch of ashes. It's fun. Isn't that fun? It's a good time. Yeah. Either way, we were there, so... All right. That was weird. Uh, Hunter looks like he forces his girlfriend to watch Transformers on mute and then makes all the sound effects himself. <laughs> Man. All right. Harry, Harry is actually a published author, which is really cool. Um, he wrote a book. It's called Room for One, Maybe Two. And the whole book is just him being really modest about how many dicks he can fit in his ass. <laughs> oh, my God. I told you that was off limits. <laughs> All right. Hunter, similar to myself, has a crippling porn addiction, and uh, he actually told me in complete confidence that the only way he can come is if his girlfriend dresses up as a bee and says, you like jazz? <laughs> that wasn't worth it. <laughs> wow. Wow. Man, that really was a battle of two ends of the autism spectrum. <laughs> that was amazing. I fucking loved it. That was that was so much fun. Evan Kellum, I want first thoughts from you. Uh, I don't like that the fat comedian ate the, the the skinnier comedian's joke. When you when you made fun of him coming on feet two jokes later, he used it against you. It's unbelievable. And he literally took the food off your plate, chewed it, and spit it in your fucking face. Uh, also, I like that you're wearing a hockey jersey, but you pulled your goalie early and he kept scoring goals on you. Oh, uh, I'm going with I'm going Hunter Hurst. Hunter Hurst angrily gets a vote. Give it up for Hunter. That's unbelievable. By the way, Fujiko leave. This is getting weird. <laughs> I was scared. I was scared. All right, David, what did you think of these two? Uh, both were good. Both were great. Let's give them both a round of applause. But. Uh, the thought process that Hunter went through, I, I, I went with Hunter on that one. Okay. Yep, that's all I got. Hunter gets two. 
That's Hunter over there. That's Hunter. The face is the fat. I have the fat one. We are nervous, but we are dirt one. Good shit, you guys. Good fucking shit. I will say, like, one of you looks like a special ed teacher, and the other looks like the student. <laughs> yeah, honestly, yeah, which one? <laughs> Until that last joke, I was like, this joke is going to be the terminator, and I got to give it to Hunter for that one. Okay, Hunter wins it. Give it up for Hunter. I'm sorry, before this battle, did you call Hunter the fat one? <laughs> Fatter. <laughs> Fuck you. Uh, uh, I, uh, yeah, this was, uh, this was a great battle, uh, but one, I am not walking barefoot at either of your apartments. Uh, and two, uh, yeah, I, I gotta give it to Hunter. You're stronger all around. And uh, as much as I liked the B movie reference, they did. So, go to Hunter. Okay, Hunter gets another, and I want final thoughts from John Lindy. I, uh, I'm just gonna say my favorite joke of each which was uh, the Transformer joke. I thought, fucking rule. Very old, very fucking funny. And inhaling the ashes, it's just, <laughs> it's just fucking beautiful. Good job to both of you guys. Guys, give Thank it up you. Give it up for these two guys. Great job. Great job, thank you. Hey, thanks for watching Roast Battle Chicago right here on the YouTubes, all right? Why haven't you subscribed yet? That's right, we have a whole bunch of free stuff. You can check out full docu-series, full battles with some of the biggest names and the meanest ones in all of comedy. You can subscribe, hit that like button, and check out these videos right over here.